today I'm going to be doing my first After Effects tutorial on pan and crop and syncing trick shots and cinematics with Twixter to the beat. So first thing you want to do, add your song in and then uh, put markers where you want to, or just put markers where the beats are. So what I'm going to do is uh, rename this. You don't have to just buy this. Do it. Name it shot. So I'm at my first shot there, so what you want to do is just add your clip and click begin bracket. So we'll start there. And what you want to do is uh, line up to uh, the shot to the first beat. Like this, right? Shoots right there, so you want to do control shift D. I can't do it with Camtasia, I forget. So you want to split it. I'm going to go just three beats. I'm going to split it again. And then to the second one, you want to add Twixter Pro. And uh, I want to put this to 59.94. Uh, uh, you want to change this to contrast, one to nearest, inverse with smart blend. So you want to go one frame before it. Keyframe at 100. Click you on your keyboard to put the keyframe so you can see them. Then at the very first frame, you want to uh, change it to 400. I mean, it's optional to speed. I'll just do 300 to 400. Go in between beats. Go to 70. Uh, go to the next beat. 400. Then 70. And then 400. Now you want to highlight all of these. And uh, click F9, but I can't because I'm using Contagio. So you can just go keyframe assistant easy ease. Go to graph editor, click this button thing, then you want to highlight these, the bottom ones, and while holding shift, you want to click and drag them over to the left and to the right like that. So you have like these, um, these but, I don't know how to describe it. So, I'm going to ram preview this part out, and then we're going to see how it looks. Okay, so I have it on. Uh, oh, oh my goodness. Okay, so it's done RAM previewing. Also, you want to take. Okay, so you want to take the audio off on the clips as well. If this decides to go faster. Unbelievable. Alright. That's why I, I don't do tutorial, guys. My computer's a butthole. Okay, I'm deciding to play now. Oh my god, damn it, Kim. After Effects. What the fuck? You wanna work? Guess not. There we go. It's kind of working now. Okay, so let's let's see. I should even plays it. Why is this lagging? Nicely. So, I'm going to add my cinematic in. It's my death scene. Add it over the clip. I have no idea why it's going so slow right now. Okay, so you want to go to the end of the clip by clicking O. Come on. Hmm. Okay. We're good. Now I'm going to go to your sin. Put at the start of it. And I'm actually going to start it right here. So you want to click. Uh, no. 
right here, so you just want to DM bracket it. And to end of this, and click this, click begin bracket. I'm actually going to switch these out. So let's make it. Um, actually, let's start it right here. No, 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 control C. So wait, I'm going to make it this long. That seems good. Then all end bracket. I'm going to add Twixter Pro. And you are going to do literally the exact same thing. Point nine four. Contrast edit hands nearest inverse. One frame back. Frame at a hundred. Click you on your keyboard. Get to the start of it. Do four hundred. Then seventy. Here, four hundred. Come on. Don't. Oh, it did it. Unbelievable after effect. Okay, then you want to type in um seventy. Then go to the end. Do four hundred. Hide all of them. Easy, easy. Them. Go do this. And here, then. While wow, holding shift again, click to the left. Don't, don't do it. Don't, don't. Oh my. As soon as I don't click it, it's just. Okay. I think, I think, wait, let's do something. What the fuck are you doing after effects? Okay, I think we're good to know. What I'm gonna do is click, so you wanna hold shift, click to the left and drag it out, and click, hold, go to the right. So I'm going to, Ramp preview what we have so far for you guys. Okay, so this is what we have so far. And for my next shot, I'm gonna have it right here. That's where I want my next shot to be. So we're gonna rename it Shot. So it's looking good so far. What are we at? Eight fucking minutes. So you just want to drag it over again. Like uh, I want the shot right there, so you want to drag the shot over to it. Right there. So uh, Control Shift D. Oh, I keep forgetting he does it. I'm gonna go uh, just split it again. Then um, I'm gonna all begin bracket. So you wanna add Twixter Pro again? Fifty nine point nine four. Contrast edge hands nearest inverse. One frame back. Speed one hundred. U. 400 now you're gonna notice it's gonna go past it so like the shot will be over here but I want it to be right there but we're gonna fix that it's easy 70 400 and 70 in between again it's a pattern it's see so yeah, it's it passed it but we're gonna fix that 70, 400, seventy, and then four hundred. Now you want to hide all of them. Easy, ease them again. In the graph editor. 
I'm going to do the exact same thing as highlight them. Then hold shift again. And then. Just, okay, that's good. You got that part down, right? So we want the shop to be right here. But you're going to notice it's like. It's back here. So. What we want to do. Let's click Control Alt T. Time remap, go to the end of it, put a mark or a keyframe there. Beginning, put a keyframe there. So you want to drag the one to the right until uh, one frame before the shot. So he shoots right. So we want to go right here. And then the shot is. You can go wait right there. So the shots there, and then we're gonna add our gunshots. Drag uh, your shot to uh, its own comp. This is what I do. If it loads, click LL. <laughs> now you want to drag it to the beginning right there. And put this at like three because this is a quiet shot. Yeah, four. I want to bring it down here. Duplicate it twice. Begin bracket. And go to this one. Begin bracket. And now I'm going to re preview it out and show you what it looks like. Cause if you And you'll notice like in the kill cam like this part moves around but if you just add RSMB that'll cover it up so you notice after the shot it's slow so what I do to the top one I bring out a time remap whoa I just made it reverse like control Z so control alt T with that and then I want to say right here just put a keyframe there go to this beat and just drag it over then all end Let's see what this will look like and good enough so now we're going to just click shift on this. So then you want to right click, pre compose. You want to make sure this one is checked. I'm going to name it shot one. So now all this becomes out. So now what we want to do is control alt y. And I'm going to rename this Bumps. Now you want to you want to add Transform. And you'll get this. So I'm going to go right here and click uh, Scale. I'm going to click 1 or do 108. I'm going to do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and change it to 100. Put you on your keyboard, click, uh, oh, you want to easy, 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 too. Then, control C, then do this to 4, 5, 6, do this to every beat. Now I'm going to pause this, so this is quicker, and then I'll... Then I'll show you guys the outcome. Okay, so. Sorry, you can hear my chewing, by the way. I'm eating food. So, this is what it will look like. Or should look like. If you want to me, you gotta... Oh, I was lying. Because if you want to me, you gotta, gotta, gotta. Also, if you want to add black bars, all this do is real quick. Control Y. Bring solid comp size, whatever. 
Add jaws. New height down. Completion 90. <clears throat> so yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Hope this like, um, hope you learned something. Hope you helped it out or it helped you out. So yeah, thanks for watching.